Hey, JJ. How are you? Great to you, man. My pleasure. Thank you for sitting down here with me and sharing your most vulnerable experiences. Tommy Two Stroke? Yes, sir. Hey, Hey. Thank you so much for coming out. No problem. The world needs to know. Yeah. Yeah. First question, big question. Have you ever been abducted by aliens? <laughs> what is going on? Yeah? Yes. It's, that's a definitive yes. I have been abducted by aliens, yes. The only one that doubted it for uh, many years was me. So you didn't even believe yourself when it happened? Well, I... When and where did this happen? It was my birthday. It was a conversation. Ah, thank you for the follow, Kyle's biggest fan. Out. Police officer to get Thanks. me off of him. He put a choke on me. That's when I had the encounter with the alien intelligence. I was working on my bike. Okay. Late at night. When? Time-wise? One night, I was in bed, and all of a sudden, I just saw this really, really bright light. The bullshit light story everyone talks about. Yeah. <laughs> Frozen. <laughs> then all of a sudden, I'm in the light. I that guy's like me telling a story. I couldn't move, and I was on some type of platform. I was going up into the mm -hmm. ship. Then they did something with my mind. There was a, there's a lapse. Uh -huh. you, did you see them? So all I saw were bright lights. Like they were in, like it was bright spots. Her presence wasn't like arms, legs, feet. She was a form changer, constantly changing. Kind of more energy. Energy, but. Plasma. They put me in a cell. What? <laughs> another abductee in the cell with me. A beautiful girl. How do you know it was a Actually, she? just at the I, I didn't know it was a she. Jeez. I just perceived her as a she right. because of her voice. She tells me we might die. This might be it. And this is where it gets crazy. And so all of a sudden, I just kind of like blacked out. And when I woke up, there was a screen, but it wasn't a real screen, Whoa. like not a TV screen. But you know how like in the Bingy, future, what the you hell? can see images, Where'd that but come they're from? not really there? In the future, you can see that? Yes. Next thing I know, she's like doggy style. What is what going on in Chad? Style. She transforms into a scaly lizard thing, but still hot ass. But it, <laughs> It's not a fucking joke. What? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of things oh did you see? Oh my god. On the I saw myself, my life with people and doing things that I had no idea who they were. I was pregnant seven All right. years ago, literally. And, and you saw I, that on the screen. I saw that on the screen. Jeez. I mean within the past seven years you've met I'm pregnant within the last seven years. And you saw yourself pregnant. And I saw myself pregnant. Have you thought about the fact that your child might be an alien? Oh, wow. man. That's blowing my mind right now. If <laughs> this I is a touchy subject. To an alien child because of my abduction, mm -hmm. the government would take it and study it for whatever purposes that they would need to. I mean, I really probably shouldn't have come on the show. Yeah, well... Can we use, like, an, a different name? I'll put a bleep over it. Okay. <laughs> okay? Yeah. Yeah. Cool? I, I think that might make sense because the government oh my God. is very crafty. She yeah. actually thinks she has an alien baby. All right. Well, of course, I will bleep that for you. I appreciate that. Did, did the alien make any sound? Giggling at me. Can you Giggling. recreate what those sounds sounded like? Everything was musical. Uh, Lich, if you're still in chat, it's your final warning, man. I don't know <laughs> where this is all coming from, but okay. I don't know why you're lashing out like that. And happy. Like. Like. Yeah. Like. <laughs> That's how it sounded to wow. me. <laughs> <laughs> what the f are you laughing at, man? This has to be fake. <laughs> do you think this is a oh, no, 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 joke? No, 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 no. Why do you this has to be fake. You to be abducted. Because I'm a very open person. I like to talk to homeless people. You, you know. pointed at me when you said that. <laughs> You're sure. Yeah. Um. <laughs> homeless. When you were abducted, did you come back to Earth with any foreign objects implanted in you? Hopefully not. A <laughs> well, you can see this here. <laughs> that? Yeah, right you there? can. You can touch it. 
Whoa, that is. Device. It's like a hard. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a chip. You have a chip in your head now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> If you were to call the aliens who abducted you on the phone and they didn't pick up, what would you say on their voicemail? You have reached. Please leave a message after the tone. Friend, it's been way too long. You abducted me seven years ago. <laughs> it's time for us to uh, get together. I've been sitting here. This has to be fake. Is my baby an alien? Reach out to me. Reach out to me. What did your friends and family say when you told them about this experience? I was crazy. They didn't you think nothing else? Like, literally, you're crazy. Would you be open to singing a song about your abduction? Oh, yeah. There she was. That ass. <laughs> what? I couldn't stop. It was like a tractor beam. <laughs> the voice of my friend. The this voice is too of weird. My friend is what makes me mend every ear. <laughs> Standing. <laughs> what is with the zoom in? If there was a tender for aliens, do you think you would swipe left or right on the aliens that abducted you? I would definitely swipe right. I'd be swiping. <laughs> oh, you mean as far as a, like a match? Yeah, the dating I would definitely app. swipe right. So you wanted your alien friend to be more than just friend, but to be more like girlfriend. Yeah, because I long for her warmth and her love. And her I could have sex with anything, everything. She would ask to need a hug. It was it was greater than swiping the right is any good. Sexual experience. That hug was more sexual than anything you had ever felt. Anything I've ever felt. So you had a very real, intimate sexual experience with this alien. Yeah, it was terrible. Jesus, dude, you were scared. Chill oh, out. Freaking horrified. But you did it. Yeah. Well, I guess you could call it sex, yeah, dude. but. In the second departure, you need to chill. She asked me again. Okay. You need a hug, and I was afraid to say yes. I, I don't know why yes. you're talking like that. And, and when I woke up, I was crying. I had climaxed. Climaxed. He nutted. Now this is where it gets weird. So we're doing it, and it was freaking great. And then a tail fucking thing, like a scorpion fucking thing. It's like this, and then the grab the tail, and then the tail. I have was no like, idea. It was just really, really weird. Mm -hmm. Do you say I love you before you leave, or I, I, I say, the, I, you know, I've never had multiple orgasms in my life until that moment. It may be easy to write these people off as crazy, but <laughs> this why is too would weird. they make something like this up? There's no proof to negate the fact that maybe they've experienced something that the rest of us <laughs> only dream of experiencing. Cosmic orgasm. Oh, wow, what an interesting picture.